Again. <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. Count it like a cherry. Count it like a cherry. Oh boy, that switched up on you. Count it like a cherry. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. You guys, look, check this out. If this is your very first time to this channel and you've never been here before, then our channel name is Lips. It's spelled L-L-I-P-S, and it stands for Living Life in Positive Serenity. Now, if it is your first time or you haven't decided to subscribe yet, run over there and subscribe for us. And then after you subscribe, make sure you hit the notification bell beside the word subscribe so that you'll be notified each and every time that we upload a video. And then, welcome to the Lips family. Listen, you guys, on the Lips channel, we call ourselves the Legion because we want to live our lives positively and we want to gain as many people as we can to let them have the opportunity to do that along with us. Now, this is what we do every day, you guys, in order to ensure that we can reach as many people as we want to because this thing helps us grow. That thing is, we want you to comment, comment, comment like you share and go on and take for the team. Comment like you share and go on and take for the team. Comment like you share and don't forget to comment like a share. Comment like a share. Comment like a share. Don't forget to comment like a share. Comment like a share. Comment like a share. Don't forget to. You guys, don't forget to comment like a share. Okay, you guys. Now, with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and pray, and then we're going to get into the food, okay? Here we go. Amen. Okay, you guys, this morning, we've already prayed. Today is day 23 of our Lips channel, Nothing But Water Awareness. 23 of 30, you guys, this time next week, we'll be on our last day. <laughs> Yay! So, you guys, my friend, you love him. He came again to remind us that we're drinking nothing but water. Big Ben is in the building, baby. Big Ben is here. Big Ben is here, you guys, to remind us, like I said, that we're drinking nothing but water for the 30 days. He has nothing in him but refreshing water. Thank you so much, Big Ben. We appreciate you, Big Ben. He said, "We don't. I don't appreciate him enough. But yes, I do, Big Ben. Let's see if you're refreshing today. Quit showing that. Yes, he is. But guess, Big Ben didn't come along, y'all. We have a dark beverage. A dark beverage is here, you guys. Today, we had a little bit of champagne left, so I just made it some of them outside. Some of them outside. Okay, so we have mimosas as a dark beverage today, you guys. Here we go. Mmm. Ah, that's good. That's good. Okay, y'all yeah, have a good. Okay, now for the food, you guys, we just have simple bacon and eggs. That's it. And y'all know it's going to have all the pinyon. That's all we got. So, we have bacon and eggs. Now, throw it inside. I've got the cayenne pepper. And just a little hot sauce. That's all I need with this, y'all. So, we don't have like a whole, whole, whole life set out. So, I'm going to go and do that first. And then I'm going to tell you why we simply only have bacon and eggs today. Okay? So, the shout out for being first on the video yesterday was Sam's World, Harmony Jones. And Margaret Willingham. 
Thank you so much for being first on the video. And you guys that weren't first, I love you all yet and still. But I want you to be first. And if you tell me that you can't be first, you are lying to me. And I know you lying. Period. <laughs> you guys, I want you guys to so all be first so I can say all of you guys' names. But thank you to these three for being first on the video on yesterday. So, you guys, I've also added Miss or Mr. because I didn't find out. Tracy Smith to our special prayer list. They've asked us to pray for them. Now y'all we want to do that. Do not forget, Tracy Smith is going to be added to our prayer list. Now ask for our prayers, Legion. Let's please do that for them. Please do that for them. This hot sauce is cold. I just got out of the refrigerator. You don't want to come out this morning. I'll get it out of there if I got to take the top off of it. So, y'all just please pray. Mmm. Mmm. We'll try to smell. Okay. Oh. For our challenge shout outs. Um, our challenges. You guys, we have several. Mmm. We have several channels. To do our uh, challenges, the lip popsicle challenge. It is a pepper that is stuck right there in this hot sauce. It won't let my hot sauce come through. So, first, for the channel shout outs today, y'all, how rude to me. I didn't give y'all a nail bite there. Let me give y'all a bite. Let me give y'all eggs. I don't know if you can see it. I don't know if it's gonna be it's just eggs. It's scrambled eggs. Now here you go, song with the hot sauce on it. I'm sorry, y'all. Mmm. You know you on the right channel, baby, baby. You know you on the right channel. I'm waiting to start. So you guys look. I tell us out on the. Uh, Lip Pops in the Challenge. We had Eminate Much Down. Thank you, Eminate Much Down. I appreciate that. You guys did so, 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 so great. I appreciate that, y'all. We also had My Three and Me. Great, 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 great. You guys, they all, I was entertained with all these guys, but My Three and Me. I love your channel name, and thank you so much for doing our challenge. And we also had Una Poco Loco. Let me make sure I get this right. Una Poco Loca. That's how it is. Una Poco Loca. Uh, Una Poco Loca. I'm sorry if I'm saying it wrong so hard, but that's how I'm going to say it, okay? Thank you guys so, 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 so much. She had both well, all three of them really is just that M and H, uh, her son is older. Her son is older. So, I mean, he's like a teenager. And these other two channels have small children on them. Okay. So, well, all of them are parent children channels. And then from Una, did that pepper go, y'all? Come on here, Big Ben. We ain't talking out on screen today, Big Ben. Mm. Okay. Y'all know how I like my bacon. You know what I told y'all. I like it kind of floppy, but still brown when well, get a piece of bacon. Mmm, get your piece of bacon. So. I mean, you guys, last but not least, is Miss Marsha Bodacia. You guys, I just found out yesterday that Miss Marsha Bodacia even had a channel. And she's been on my channel for a while, and she's a great supporter. 
Well, I definitely want to give a shout out to Miss Marsha Bodacious. Remember, you guys, her little daughter, Blue Harmony, made um, this, the little um, clip of my intro. Yeah, she did. As a matter of fact, I'm going to put that clip on the video today. So by the time you can hear, you've already seen it, but now you know why it's there. And plus, I love it. But, specifically about this channel, y'all, Miss Marsha Bodacia, she combined my talent, which was the Lips 10 Popsicle Challenge, with the Be Love's Life Sing Everything Challenge. That was so creative. I thought that was so creative. And I loved it. You guys, all of these challenges are in our Lip Popsicle Challenge playlist. And I put them all in the community post. Now, one other thing about that. Miss Una Poca Poca Loca. Her husband also did the challenge because she was struggling with the kids, with the babies. His name is Big Coles. He did as well. I put it in the community post as well. Thank you so much. I appreciate all of you guys for doing the challenges. We appreciate you guys. We love you all. So, with that being said, also before I forget, Miss Marsha Bodacious, because she combined my challenge with Be Love's Life Challenge, I pinned her on Instagram as well. So she's the second person behind Miss Tanya Zellner to be put in our Two Lips Instagram page. Thank you so much, Marsha Bodacious. We appreciate you. So, now, I need to tell you guys, the sizes on the Teespring merch, I'm working with them. I'm waiting on emails back to try to get the sizes increased up to a 5X for those who may need it. I'm doing my best. I'm working on it. I have gotten over there now. I am active on both the Instagram page, which I don't know how to work very well, y'all. But I'm over there. And our Facebook page. So I'm over there working on both of those. Yay! Don't forget to comment like I said. Comment like I said. Comment like I said. Don't forget to. I'm on both of those platforms. Over there with you. Try to see how you doing. Letting you know I love you. And having my mouth touched. That ice hit my tooth. Can't have that. So, with all that being said, I think I got it all covered. Now, I done ate it now, though. But I wanted to tell y'all why this morning we just simply had bacon and eggs. You guys, when I was a child, when I was a child, when mama got breakfast ready, or lunch ready, or dinner ready, she sat down to the table, and you could pretty much pick any plate that she sat down if you were a child, because... And you didn't have choices about what it was you was going to eat. You ate what mama fixed, how she fixed it, and that what you ate. If you didn't, you went to bed hungry. And that's what it was. You didn't have an opinion about grown people and what they said or what they said you were going to eat and stuff like that when I was a child. You either ate what they put down there or you with the bed hungry, honey. So, when I was a child, I liked rice. I liked biscuits. I liked all those things. But what I really wanted to eat was bacon and eggs. So, I said when I became an adult, when I wanted breakfast, if I wanted to, I wasn't going to have nothing but bacon and eggs. I wasn't having nothing else. And I was not going back on it. So a lot of the time when I eat breakfast, that's all I eat. 
It's just bacon and eggs. Those are my favorite two things about breakfast. Bacon and eggs. Now, I said that to say, okay, you know I'm a YouTuber. So, I'm on YouTube a lot. And I see these channels. Hold on, y'all, let me move this. Let me get this out of the way. Mm. Excuse me. I see these channels that have these children on it. Um, especially children. Just say children. And I noticed that these children, they rule the world, basically. Um, you know, the children eat what they want, eat how they want. I don't want this. I don't want that. Don't give me that. And there's nothing wrong with that. Everybody has their own parenting, their own parenting skills and their own parenting, um, you know, the way that they parent their children. And I certainly don't have a problem with it. Um, but times have just changed. The way that we treat our children, and, and this includes me, because my child, my daughter, you know, I give her what she wants. I do. But she's very respectful. You know, she's going to do her chores. Yes, she has chores at six years old. She wipes down the coffee tables. That is her chore to do and clean up her room with help, of course. But she has chores. Yes, she does. She's now learning how to wash dishes. She's learning how to cook. She's learning all these things. Because when they're that young, my daughter's six, their brains can suck up and sponge up everything that you give to them. And I'm going to tell you something. I cannot be anywhere at any time, at any age she is, and be embarrassed because she's disrespectful toward me. That will not happen. So, she gets a lot. Yes, she does. But most of it is in reward for her being a great child. She's a really, really a great child. So, with that being said, come here, Big Ben. Come here, Big Ben. So, what I uh, said all that to say, when I was a child, you didn't get an opportunity to say much about anything that you ate or anything. If a grown person said something to you, it didn't have to be your parent. If a grown person said something to you when I was a child, you shut up, you listened so you could get all the instructions correct and get to doing what they told you to do. It was not only just your, your parents. It was an adult period. So I said that to say, you know, the times have changed, you guys. So children have a lot more to say. You know, you may walk up on a person's child and you say something to them and they say, yeah, or no, or anything. Now, my child's not going to say that. And I don't think there's anything wrong with people's children who do. Because some people don't see that as a sign of disrespect and I respect that you know if that's the relationship that you have with your child or whatever I respect that or whatever but children have a lot more say about themselves and what they're going to do what they're going to eat where they're going to go what they're going to wear that kind of stuff than we did when we were children so with that being said if we are teaching them differently because that's what's happening we're teaching them differently why can't we teach them differently if we're going to teach them differently why can't we teach them differently? Why, you guys, I'm seeing this stuff on the internet where people have little children already saying very, very hateful things toward people. They're already, I mean, these are little kids, four or five years old, already hating people, already calling people names, already ostracizing groups of people. You know, whether it be people in my lifestyle or people of my color or and, and even people of my color doing it toward other races. You guys, if we're going to teach them differently, let's teach them better. Why would we teach them? Why would we allow them to have the luxuries of the times changing? But don't try to change the time through them. You guys, we've got to do better, you guys. And that starts with prayer. That starts with our children, you guys. Our children are our future. They're our future. And you guys, if we... The Bible says that each day that we live, we get weaker and wiser. We're going to get weaker in our body, but wiser in our heads. So with that being said, you guys, 
We, this is how we make the world a better place. This is how we make the world stronger. Because like I told you guys before, we done already messed it up for us. We done messed it up. Yes, we've came leaps and bounds from where we used to be. Yes, we have with a whole lot of things. But that doesn't change that the world, we haven't fixed it by today, you guys. We have not fixed it. You guys, so I said that to say, yes, times have changed. And yes, we do treat our children differently. We do, because like I said, when I was a child, if I see something back to my mama, pow. I mean, you know, it just was that way. That's how you raise children in those days. And I thank, I'm so, so thankful for that. It made me be the person I am today. You know, it made me learn to respect others, to respect my elders, to say yes, ma'am, and no, no ma'am, and stuff like that. I was so thankful for that upbringing. So I, it was just a random thought I was having, you guys. It really, really was because I was watching something this morning on YouTube and it was a small child, you know, saying very, very ugly things toward a specific group of people. And it just wasn't nice. So I came up with a little idea that because when I was a child, I wasn't allowed to have just bacon and eggs. I had to eat whatever was put before me. I would just make bacon and eggs because that's what I like. And just to get into that conversation, let you guys know, you guys, our children are our futures. Our children are the ones who we can make a change in the world. So, you guys, let's do that. Let's make a change with our children. I'm working on mine. So, you work on yours. And if you see mine, help me work on mine. And we're going to do this together. It takes a village and a world to raise these children to, be, to make this world a better place tomorrow than it's not today. So... Just a little chit chat. Plus, I wanted to come and see you guys because, you know, we went live yesterday. We didn't, didn't have a video yesterday. And I love you all. So, to the people that were first, I'm working on the sizes uh, for the Teesprings to get them bigger. Uh, Marshall Bodacious, that was a great, excellent idea that you had. Thank you guys so much. You guys, tomorrow, I'm going to come and have, I'm going to, actually, we're going camping today when I get off of here. After I do the live that we're going to have, we're going camping for Father's Day. Uh, you know, my father passed uh, almost now in July, three years ago. And so every year for Father's Day, we go camping for my father. That's just our Father's Day thing, me and my husband and my daughter. So we're going camping uh, today, but I'm going to drive back tomorrow and do our Sunday dinner and then go back to the campsite. Well, I'm not going to drive, but I'm coming back home tomorrow to do our Sunday dinner and then go back to the campsite. I love you guys just that much. So, with that being said, I said that, I said that. I'm going, you guys, don't forget, we need to be praying for Miss Tracy Smith uh, or Mr. Tracy Smith. I do not know if it's a man or woman, but Tracy Smith, make sure we keep them in our prayers. I'm going to add them to the special prayer list. I thank you guys so, so, so much for tuning in again for this just a little simple breakfast just to come and look at lips, I guess. I appreciate you guys so, so, so much for being here. Now, in closing, y'all know what time it is now. Everybody know what time it is. Let's go on and get it out the way. Mm. Oh, I love that for breakfast. So, go and take it for the team. Comment, like, and share, and go. Don't forget to comment, like, and share. Comment, like, and share. Comment, like, and share. Don't forget to. You guys, I love you guys so much. And in closing, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. My camera went out. I'm so, so, so sorry. My camera went out, but listen, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, you guys. Remember, you guys, when there's obstacles in your life, there's always more than one way home. All you still have to do is get there. So get there, people. Get there. I love you all. Thank you guys so, 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 so much for being so great. I'm going to see you guys in live at 2 o'clock. At 2 o'clock, we're going to be live. I love you all so, 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 so much. You guys, please pray. They don't know Bear told me and my family off over here at the campsite, y'all. I love you all. See you guys. Bye-bye. Not quite yet. Focus back in. You guys, let's make the world better for tomorrow. You guys, let's teach our children better. Let's teach them acceptance and love of other people. I love you all so, 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 so much. Don't forget that if you are having a hard time, I keep the suicide hotline number in our description box. You guys, the Teespring description box for our lips uh, apparel, our lips merch is in the description box as well. I love you all. Thank you guys so, 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 so much. Now, this time, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. We ain't gonna go back through it all, but I love you guys so much. See you guys next time. And if you're not here next time, you have lied to me. And I know you lied.
Period. Bye-bye.